Hey guys, today we're going to do a quick tutorial for this fun flowery makeup look. Um, I've never actually been to a music festival before, but it would definitely be awesome for that or any other fun spring or summer event. So let's just jump right into this. As always, I'm starting by priming my eyes with the Balms Put a Lid on It eye primer. After I've rubbed that in, I'm going to be starting off with an eyeshadow from my Jules palette with E-Unique Beauty. Some of you guys may know about it. It was available briefly in December and it'll be coming back this spring, so definitely keep an eye out for that. I will have more videos about it up soon. I'm using the shade Dawn, which is a peachy pink color, and I'm really like slowly building up the transition in my crease using a Sigma E35 brush. This formula is extremely pigmented, so I'm building it up little by little to get a softer effect. So around the very edge of that peachy color, I'm blending a tiny bit of yellow eyeshadow using a Sigma E25. So now I'm going to be using one of Dose of Color's new cream eye colors, which can be used as eyeliners or eyeshadows. As you can see, I'm sort of using a padding motion to buff it out. It's like a whipped gel texture and they dry matte and they do not budge or crease at all once they've dried. I've actually been loving using these as eyeshadow, but you do have to blend it fairly quickly since it does dry and set. Anyways, the shade that I'm using is called Sleepover and I'm using another Sigma E25 brush to blend it around my crease, my lower lash line, and also carrying some down onto the outer portion of my lid. I'm going in with a Sigma E36 and another eyeshadow from the Jules palette. This one is called Chasm. It's a deep plum purple color. It's definitely my all-time favorite eyeshadow on earth and that is saying something because I love eyeshadows. I'll talk way more about the palette and all the shades in it because I'll be making a few videos like based solely on the palette since it will be relaunching soon, but for this look I'm just building up the purple in my crease and also bringing it along my lower lash line. And then I'm going to be taking a Luxie 229 brush and really buffing it out. So now I'm going to be carving out the inner half of my lid. I'm using a Sigma F75 brush and Kat Von D's Locket Foundation. Once I've done that, I'm going back in with Chasm and just darkening the edge of the eyeshadow right above where I've cut the crease. I'm patting a bit of yellow shadow over that for now and then adding some of CoverFX's Mirage Glitter Drops. I'm using the glitter drops on my inner corner and also using a Sigma E04 brush to add some to my brow bone. On the rest of my lid, I'm using Dose of Colors Lemon Drop Ideal Duo. This product consists of a cream and a pigment, so I'm first adding the cream and then patting the pigment over top of that. I just want to point out that it's a beautiful glam look if you just stop at this step and add liner and lashes. But as you know, we have a few more steps to go, so anyways, now I'm just going to get started with the eyeliner. I'm using a Suva 610 brush and their white hydra liner to add a white line along that edge of the cut crease. So to get started on the daisies, I'm just making a few dots to plan where each flower will go. Then I'm creating five petals around each dot. I'm making sure to be really careful. There's not really any way to describe how I'm doing this, but it does help to stabilize yourself with your pinky if you're trying to keep a steady hand while doing this. Now I know you guys have been asking me to show the palettes or products that I'm using. I got a ton of comments on one of my recent videos, like, like an overflow of comments asking to show the product and a few people were like mad that I didn't. So I totally apologize for that and I really want to start showing the product. It slipped my mind while I was filming this video and I don't want to make you guys like wait any longer um for me to edit and have this up but i promise i will definitely start doing that so thank you guys for letting me know and i apologize but i will definitely start showing the products i'm using nyx halo eyeliner for the yellow center of the flowers and also adding little yellow dots between each one just for some extra decoration once I'm done with that, I'm adding some eyeliner on my upper lash line. I'm using a Dose of Colors eyeliner brush and another one of their cream colors. This one is black, obviously, and it's called Shady, and I'm also putting it along my lower lash line. Before falsies, I'm using Sigma Sinuosity Mascara. 
Then I'm putting on Lily Lashes in the style Ella to complete the look. Also wanted to tell you guys that the lash glue that I use is from Iris Beauty. I get a lot of questions about that. And the applicator that I use to apply my lashes is from Artemis Lashes. I think I just said lashes like 10 times, but you guys get the point. So here's the look. I hope you guys love this tutorial. But as always, um, leave me any thoughts, ideas, or requests you have down below. And do not forget to subscribe. I love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next video.